Hello and welcome to this tutorial everybody. I have an existing game in which there is a simple collision. Um, I look towards my target and I hit by pressing the mouse key and the mouse button hits the target. The bullet gets fired and it hits the target and it destroys it. So it's a simple game uh, right now but I'm going to add some sound to it so whenever it hits the target it should also have a tick sound or, or play a sound. So right now I have this prefab the cannonball and it has this script actually applied on it so whenever there's on collision enter it simply just destroys that target so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna add a component over here and it's an audio component audio source and for this audio source I need to supply a clip an audio clip over here which I already have imported into my project uh, make sure that component has been you know the selected you don't remove that selection and from the property inspector and just drag and drop this sound. Now this is a tick sound which I've just downloaded from soundbible.com. You can also download uh, different sounds and you can use them. This is a wave. You can use wave or mp3. So I just drag and drop this on the audio clip on the new audio source component which I've added to my prefab, the cannon, um, the cannonball prefab. And it won't yet play. And please remember whenever you create a new audio source and you add a new audio clip please untick the play on awake and now we need to do the programming so whenever there's a collision it should play automatically so before uh, the collision comes in I need to add a variable here say public audio source uh, this this the type the data type I'm, I'm gonna uh, give it a variable name let's say tick source and I'm gonna assign this tick source whenever in the start the script is started I need to get the component uh, audio source audio source which is a function and I assign it over here the tick source so basically what I'm saying is this audio source which is audio clip gets uh, assigned to the uh, audio source the data type variable which I have and now when I'm saying whenever the collision happens I would say tick source dot play that's the function I want to invoke so let's save this and let's start so whenever I play the game and there is a target hit by the the, the cannon there's a tick sound and it gets destroyed thank you very much thanks for watching